Hello Taurus and welcome to Fifi and Gigi's Tarot Reading. I'm super excited to do your reading today because I'll be covering the entire month of July 2023 in the areas of career, finance and romance. So Taurus, thank you so much for joining me and for those who are new, a big welcome. So Taurus, let's get started with your big reading for July 2023 and let's find out what is the big energy and that is we have the knight of swords here fantastic here the knight of swords is the fastest moving knight here so this is very very fast movement coming your way here for the month of july and again this could be offers promotions and changes any changes in your life here there is a disclaimer here with very very fast energy and very fast changes coming your way it's also good not to be too impulsive here take your time not to rush decisions of course yes make a decision but do not rush it though taurus and take your time think things through before you make a decision however let's get started with your reading taurus and let's find out what's in store for you july 2023 here fantastic okay let's get started Okay, Taurus, your current situation, we have, great, the Knight of Wands here. The Knight of Wands is all about projects that you are very, very passionate about. There's something that you're very good at. There's something that you have a skill. There's a project that really inspires you. There's something that really makes you feel alive. Butterflies in your stomach too. Now, again, this could be a side hustle. This could be your employment, a business. A YouTube channel anything but you do have quite the gift though Taurus with what you have and with your skills here I feel like also there could be someone that could be a fire sign uh, could be Leo Sagittarius Aries that could also take potential potential with you so offer you something too someone in in a position where again it could be someone a business owner owner that could be offering you something here but again I feel like you do have quite the skill you can literally sell anything you kind of like have the gift of the gap here taurus you can do anything you can sell anything you can produce money you can do literally anything your challenge though you do have the eight of cups here now with the eight of cups here this is the only card that this person shows their back here now there could be a situation here where uh, a situation that no longer serves you now, again, this could be a relationship, this can be work, this can be friends, family, literally anything here. But this person is walking towards the sun here. So the challenge here is having the courage to end something. It's about having the courage to walk away from something that no longer serves you, Taurus. And you also have, wow, the king of swords here. Nice. The King of Swords is an air sign. There could be someone, uh, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra here. It could be someone in a very high position. It could be, again, a doctor, a politician, soldier, someone that doesn't think with their heart, thinks with their head. So, again, I feel like there could be someone in July that you could be dealing with that could be helping you also. To get, to get through, though, to the King of Swords, it's all about clear communication. It's all about being very logical, being... Um, setting facts because again like I said the king of swords is someone that thinks very logically so to get through to this person you have to present facts you have to be very um, very straightforward not talk around in circles you need to be very straight on with this person the foundation though with your reading is the seven of cups here fantastic you have options Taurus more than one option lots of choices here and again, this could be, be be presented with more than one offer here, more than one job, more than one business. There's a lot of options here. Now, you may feel a little bit overwhelmed. You may feel a little bit, you don't know which decision to make. The best thing to do is to ground yourself. Make sure you ground yourself, Taurus, for July, and you'll be able to make a decision. Now, again, I want to point this out. This is close to the Knight of Swords. Some 
offer may come very very fast because it is the fastest night and you may feel a little bit overwhelmed here ground yourself and you'll be you'll find the answer on what you want to do now thoughts we do have the ten of pentacles here fantastic here so you are thinking long term here Taurus you are thinking how can I improve my money how can I invest long term how can I have a strong foundation now this will require because it is above the challenge this will require for you to make a change here this will require for you to end something in order to move forward with your finances in order to make that shift and change the near future we have the ten of cups beautiful happy home life this is literally your happy ever after Taurus so yes definitely expect um, abundance in all areas of your life expect to have a strong foundation and just happiness and fulfillment this is beautiful your point of view oh my god the six of wands recognition celebrations you're going to accomplish something Taurus you can see here the accolades around this person here you're very good at something but this did not come overnight this took years this took practice sacrifice there's going to be people clapping for you people are going to be watching you however this this does bring jealousy there will be jealous people around you Taurus but do not worry you keep doing what you are doing because it's going to be recognition if you do if you get invited to parties ceremonies go please go because this is victory this is a victory coming it's like coming after battle and being rewarded for all your hard work here you want to see yourself for who you are you want to see yourself accomplishments you want to see yourself getting out there and accomplishing everything your environment you also have judgment here now judgment is a major arcana you're going to have a major epiphany too in July you're going to be making I'm not going to say tough decisions that's not the word you're going to make a decision an important decision that's going to change everything and again you're finally going to see things with eyes opened here judgment speeds up the process so there won't be any delays here judgment is going to speed up the process here and again this process can be walking away from something making a choice here and getting your happy ever after here hopes wishes and actions yep we have the four of cups here the universe is going to present you with an opportunity here Taurus the universe is literally going to give you a cup so yes you may be thinking that you're in a routine at the moment it's mundane at the moment that's going to pass here because again that's just above the judgment judgment is going to change that completely there's going to be a shift now changes now the outcome we also have the tower here the tower is also the destruction of old foundations here this is I believe this is highly linked to also the eight of cups here again there could be the ending of a business the ending of employment some sort of ending here however though with the tower also comes a positive which is you can rebuild usually when the tower happens it's meant to happen the tower is forcing us to make a change the tower is forcing us to do that shift I do feel that it's very highly linked to this card for the challenge but let's get some confirmation cards let's find out exactly what your spirit team wants you to know what is it that they are urging you to know or do also one more shuffle Taurus excellent let's pop the cards the current situation has been confirmed with beautiful the nine of Pentacles here so money looks really good Taurus this is the independence card you have independence you have money to spend without looking at the price tag so again this is all thanks to your passions 
having the gift of the gap, having the skills, having literally, you're, it's, I, I'm going to say that you're kind of like the magician here. You're able to manifest anything. You're able to do anything here. And again, there is abundance in your areas in terms of money here. And you do have independence too. I'm going to take out another card. We have the Three of Cups. Again, Three of Cups is celebrating the milestones, celebrating engagements, weddings, um, parties. So again, Taurus, whatever you get invited to, go. It's good to celebrate the little things. It's good to celebrate the littlest milestones. I don't care how big or small, but celebrate. Let's look at your challenge. You did have the uh, Eight of Cups that's also been confirmed with the King of Pentacles here. This is literally you, Taurus. You are in, in a high position. Again, you probably manage people here. You're very structured. You're very disciplined. And you are very generous. You do help people. You help them with your advice, your guidance. I wouldn't be surprised if people look up to you. But you also have the Seven of Cups. You've gotten this twice here. There are a lot of options here. You may feel a little bit overwhelmed and you don't know which one to take. Like I said before, it's very important to ground yourself. It's very to look at situations from a different angle and look if it does serve you or not. However, though, I do feel like you are going to be walking away, though, Taurus. I because with these cups, they're showing their back. I feel like... You're going to be thinking about it. You're going to weigh out your options here and you're going to be walking away. With the King of Swords here, you also have the Queen of Swords here. Communication is very key for the month of July. As you can see, this person holding the sword up. Remember with the Queen of Swords, someone that's very sharp-tongued, very they think with their heart, not with their... Sorry, they think with their head, not with their heart. It's exactly what the King and the Queen of Swords do. They literally remove emotions from the situation too. What you have to do, what, what's happening here, Taurus? Because again, like I said, having the options with the Eight of Cups, it's very, very important before you make this decision to really think about your next move. You, you've had this again. It's come out twice, the Eight of Cups. What's happening here, you're going to think about it. Because the sword is pointing up, you're going to communicate it. But you need to communicate it very clearly here. Communicate your clear intentions here, Taurus. You are definitely going to be walking away. You're going to end some sort of, yeah, a situation that no longer serves you here. I am picking up this is more a career that you're going to end. Because, yeah, we, because, because, because we do have queens and kings here, yeah, this is like people in an important industry, important business corporation. The foundation you did have, yes, Seven of Cups also been confirmed with the King of Wands here. Okay, King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands, like I said, you've gotten this twice. Someone that can sell anything, someone that can do, has the gift of the gap, able to do anything here. But you're going to be presented with options here. You're going to be presented something of your skills with the Eight of Pentacles. You can see this person working very hard, but they are surrounded by pentacles here. So I would not be surprised if you get more than one employment offer here. And the thing is, though, with the Two of Wands, Taurus, you're not going to know which one to take. <laughs> because Wands, again, are all about your passions. It's all about your projects here, what you're good at here. You're not going to know which option to take and you're going to reach. It's like reaching a crossroad here. Do not worry because Taurus, I can very confidently say you cannot make a wrong decision here. You can't. Whatever option you're presented with, they're all good. Just don't be impulsive. Ground yourself and you'll make a decision. Your thoughts has also been confirmed with the hermit here. Fantastic. What I love about the Hermit is it's also a major arcana, very Virgo. It's good to isolate yourself. Your spirit team is going to force you to isolate, to think. They're going to start downloading information to you. In other words, the Hermit, it's very Virgo energy. You're going to start receiving information. 
it's it's the perfect time to think things through evaluate reassess you have life experience now Taurus you have the knowledge and the wisdom to make decisions to make your next move do not be surprised if your spirit team starts giving you ideas spontaneous ideas don't just ignore them don't ignore your ideas don't ignore things that come to you your outcome you did have the ten of cups that's also been confirmed with the four of wands beautiful four of wands is also about investment perhaps you may consider buying an investment property leasing a business starting a business moving into a new home renting a property renting a business again happy home life looks promising things are going to improve in the lot in the home life things are going to be looking fantastic in your point of view this is also you also have the empress fantastic this is the queens literally wrapped up into one here this is the most abundant card here it's also about giving birth to an idea an idea coming into fruition here you may consider a pregnancy in the future with your family perhaps yes pregnancy looks definitely on the cards here but again this is with the um six of wands it's victory winning victory getting recognition seeing yourself successful seeing yourself finally getting what you really really want and your environment has also been confirmed with the chariot fantastic this is the fastest moving um major arcana this is cancer season now we are already in cancer season with the judgment it's going to speed up more the process this is good news coming your way it's highly linked to overseas also you may be dealing with people with overseas um, I can see probably maybe zoom meetings phone calls so good news are definitely coming your way hopes wishes and actions you have the ace of swords here the ace of swords is brand new beginnings this cup that's been offered by the universe is a brand new beginning here this is mental breakthrough mental determination breaking through the challenges obstacles oppositions but it does require you to be firm and very determined Taurus the tower has been confirmed with the two of Pentacles here now again this is all about juggling indecision now yes you may have to juggle your finances a bit because if you're going to be walking away from a situation yes there could be a decrease of money and you're trying to do the balancing act of trying to pay everything do not worry that's going to pass because you also have the ten of cups this has been confirmed twice here the ten of cups is the happy home life Taurus having it all abundance in all areas of your life a strong foundation and you're happy ever after Taurus um, Taurus so Taurus again you have nothing to worry about I'm going to pull out one more card the ten of Pentacles you've gotten this twice here ten of Pentacle Pentacles money looks good money to share money to spend money that brings calmness peace this is fantastic you can definitely see here how the just it, it's just bursting with money here it's going to require you to definitely walk away from something it's going to require you um, Taurus to end something to be able to move on to be able to expand yourself to live to your best potential here I'm going to take out a purpose card Taurus and see what are your final messages here the first card we have healer you have a spiritual gift of healing and a desire to share it with others beautiful again you may be changing your career in more of a medical industry a counselor a doctor a wise counselor again this change this this big change that you are going to do you have a gift for it Taurus 
literally a gift. You have the magic touch to heal others. Second card, practice. Polish your skills by practicing regularly. It's, it's always good to practice. It's always good to polish your skills. Because there's always room to improve. There's always room to do better, Taurus. And lastly, artists. Engaging in artistic activities is beneficial to your career and every other area in your life. Do you find that balance too? Apart from work, Taurus, find that time to explore new ho hobbies. Especially in the artistic world, in the domain of artists. Explore new interests, new experiences, hobbies. Try something new here. Because you have something wonderful to look forward to. I feel like if you make this change, Taurus, it's going to even surprise you. This, this absolute shift. Because there's going to be happiness and abundance in all areas of your life here. Trust your instincts too. Follow your dreams. And you will see the positive change here. I want to thank you, Taurus, for joining me in this reading. I wish you the absolute best for the month of July. And I'll see you at the next reading. Bye for now.